Okay, I'd like to uh, say a few things about the VCG mechanism before I close the dominant strategy mechanism design. So remember the VCG mechanism basically comes with an efficient decision rule which maximizes the total payoffs. Uh, and then the transfer function is, is this. So therefore the VCG mechanism is basically this tuple D and T. Well, uh, the pivotal mechanism and Vick reaction implements the same social choice function, which is what we basically just shown in the previous uh, episodes. Well, in some settings, um, the, for example, the public good settings, the VCG mechanism is not budget balanced. Well, if you remember the budget balancedness, it was the summation of the transfers must be equal to zero for every theta. But so VCG violates budget balance. This basically means there are some uh, type profiles where the summation of the transfers is strictly less than zero. Well, this is not a, 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 an important problem, for example, in the auction environment. Why? Because uh, the winners will uh, is supposed to make a payment and those payments goes to the mechanism designer or the auctioner. However, in some environments, as, as in the public goods settings, uh, the transfers are between the agents. So one agent makes a transfer to another agent. And so one agent's uh, uh, sort of a, a negative transfer is another agent's positive, positive transfer. At least this is uh, what we expect. However, in those environments, it could be the case that uh, the budget balancedness is not satisfied. Well, that's a problem because uh, remember we talked about efficiency of the decision rule, but we didn't really talk about the efficiency of the uh, social choice function. So yes, the VCG mechanism is efficient in terms of its decision rule, but as a social choice function, uh, the VCG mechanism is actually may not be efficient. All right, when we consider the transfer as well as a part of efficiency, uh, VCG actually may fail to satisfy efficiency uh, because of the budget balancedness. Well, in some settings, uh, VCG also violates individual rationality, meaning uh, the individuals or the participants of the mechanisms have no incentive to participate to the mechanism at the first place. Well, uh, what do we mean by individual rationality? Individual rationality means once we sort of normalize the payoffs in such a way that the utility of uh, agent I uh, utility of agent I, regardless of his declaration, regardless of the other's declarations, the decision rule and the transfer, his utility should be greater than or equal to zero. If this is the case for every theta, well then we say the, uh, the, the mechanism is individually rational, but VCG fails to satisfy this, meaning there are some environments where some agent's utility may actually be negative. Uh, where zero represents uh, the utility of not uh, participating to the mechanism. So that's a, a bad thing because as a mechanism designer, if you, uh, if you think the VCG is going to work because it's strategy proof, well, that's wonderful, but nobody or some people have no incentive to enter. So that's a problem because uh, you want all, you know, all the candidates to enter to your mechanism. Uh, but some of them have actually no incentive to enter. All right, so that's, that's a problem as well. So VCG is, uh, so to speak, not a perfect solution. Well, but nevertheless, it's one of the, well, not one of the, it's the best solution we have uh, because it is in some environments, uh, because it, is, it satisfies strategy proofness. Everybody is going to reveal their type truthfully. And again, it, it, this, this result is true only in quasi-linear utility environments uh, in the sense that, remember, the quasi-linear utility function is like V minus T guy. So the V is the utility, but also there's a transfer component in it. And so the transfer is linearly incorporated into the utility function U, the, the, the whole utility function. And so we call it a quasi-linear utility environment. In this environment, uh, VCG mechanism is a strategy-proof mechanism. But as I said, uh, it has uh, some 
uh, problems. S not always, but in some environments, it, it violates budget balancedness and violates individual rationality. Um, so this is it for the uh, dominant strategy implementation, uh, dominant strategy mechanism design. Next, we are going to start talking about Bayesian, uh, Bayesian uh, mechanism design theory.